Hi, my name is Courtney, and this is my revival story. When I was 10, I was diagnosed with cancer in my left leg, um, and I honestly didn't know what to do about this, but the only option was to go through with treatments. Um, so I went through with the treatments. It was about two and a half years, um, a 16 hour long surgery, um, and just a lot of things that um, normal healthy kids don't usually have to go through. And then after that, I was okay, but I was still learning how to walk again because of the surgery. And I was placed into my same public school and didn't really know how to interact with kids my own age. Um, and so going throughout middle school was tough. I got in some trouble and in high school um, I was carrying so much bondage and I got diagnosed with depression and anxiety and PTSD because of um, I never went to counseling for my cancer. Um, and I'd seen things that no kid should ever see um, and I never had worked through it and didn't have a relationship with Jesus yet so I didn't really know how to process it. Um, and so in 10th grade through Young Life, I got saved, which was awesome. It felt so good to be saved and finally know the gospel for myself and not basing it off of my parents' faith or my church's faith. And I came to college, um, and I'm a sophomore now at JMU, but freshman year was the first time I had kind of had room to think about what was what had happened in my life because there was a lot of um, just baggage from my cancer and the depression and things at home going on. And so freshman year was a lot about rediscovering who Courtney Ott was um, and not what the world had tried to shape me to be. And so I started coming to Duck in high school a little bit, but I started coming regularly last year. And I felt so um, relieved, but I still wasn't getting everything I needed because I wasn't plugging into the community. So as soon as I started going to ENC and getting involved with um, the engines on Friday nights and um, helping out with the children and you know getting involved with some of the older people in the church and the people my age, um, I all of a sudden um, about five months ago I started feeling spirit and joy that I've never felt in my entire life. My anxiety and depression were gone. They had no name in this house. And throughout the summer, I was working at a camp, but I had time every other weekend to come back. And I just felt so relieved to be a part of this family and be able to just experience what full joy was. And even though I was saved for a few years, I still had all of this bondage. And sometimes I feel like we think, oh, we know Jesus, so I guess this is how um, He wants us to live. But in reality, He wants us to be completely set free and not holding on to anything that we have from our past um, or worries about our future. And so this is my invitation to you to come check out Duck and come with expectation. Don't think you know what the service is going to be like or what you've heard, but really experience it for yourself because it is really awesome. and. The Lord's work is being shown throughout this entire church and community. And that's my revival story. <laughs>